May is Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month. And tonight we introduce you to a young entrepreneur and Baltimorean who hopes his unique product will spark a little conversation. I grew up uh, born and raised in Baltimore. Went to the University of Baltimore for my undergrad, my MBA. So we've been, you know, engulfed into Baltimore all our lives. My first watch was an orange fossil watch. When I was 10 years old, had it, took it apart, tried to put it back together. Didn't have the best of luck with that. So I've always been obsessed with watches ever since that first watch. My obsession got more and more expensive. So I kept buying these watches and then one night I was about to buy a new watch. Uh, my wife looks over at my computer and says, Alan, stop buying so many watches. Why don't you just start your own company? Uh, she was joking, but my background's in marketing and design. So I started working on several different designs, maybe 50, 60 different designs until I finally finished one. Kind of what started the entire company back in 2017. The first watch was called the Founders Edition. But once that watch was completed, uh, it just wasn't up to our standards. So we kind of disregarded that entire design, redesigned a new watch, new manufacturers, new suppliers, and then uh, we launched it and did incredibly well. All our pieces have some kind of story behind Baltimore. For example, we did the Taurus Diver, which was named after the USS Taurus submarine right in the Baltimore Inner Harbor. A portion of those proceeds actually went to the historic ships of Baltimore to help maintain the, uh, the submarine, which is really cool. Then we did the Constellation Chrono Diver, which is named after the USS Constellation ship in Baltimore Inner Harbor. Then we moved towards the Legacy model with the MD-1 movement uh, that was actually assembled here in Maryland Watchworks in Hagerstown. You know, a lot of our watches, a lot of the companies utilize the same movement. So we wanted to differentiate ourselves. And what better luck than having a company here that can really create something unique. We have a new watch. It's called the Bolt Pilot. It's actually named after the Martin Baltimore 187 bomber plane that was actually built in Maryland. Really unique uh, pilot style uh, watch uh, that has a really cool story behind it. All our watches generally have the Maryland flag within the movement. The movement is really the heart of the watch. It's what keeps the watch moving, what keeps it beating. So like us, no matter where we are, we could be in California. Maryland is, you know, deep rooted into our heart. What we're doing in South Baltimore, we're trying to generate this community, this family. You want to go to any of the Baltimore uh, bars, Fellows Point, Federal Hill, whatever have you, and then, you know, you have a South Baltimore. It's, it's more than just a watch, it's a conversation piece. Now you're connecting with the next person across from you wearing a South Baltimore piece and you can talk, you have something in common, which is really cool. I love going out and about and just seeing people wearing the watches, you know. I'll, I'll actually come up to them and say, hey, that's an awesome watch. Uh, they don't know me, but it's like, hey, you know, that's a beautiful watch on your wrist. Uh, then we start talking and create this really cool relationship. Now, Alan is currently looking at properties in Baltimore to open a brick and mortar location. He also purchased an Airstream so he can do a mobile watch. 